Hey guys, Chris from Flow Designs. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to install our splitter on a S15 with an aero front end. Let's go. Before we get into it, I'd like to talk about the splitter and the options because there are two finishes. You can choose the gloss black finish, which is nice and pretty, or the textured finish, which is good for like track days because it's got very good scratch resistant properties. Also you've got accessories, so you've got extensions that you can adjust inwards or outwards, and also the winglets. Uh, also comes with a internal brace to give it improved rigidity, and all our hardware is black and in stainless steel. So with that out the way, let's set it up to get it installed. Before we get started, I just want to talk about the setup because there are two different ways. Uh, it comes out of the box with the spacers that will give you the correct pitch. Um, some people would like to install it hard up against the bar. So if you decide to take these out, you can swap it with one of our spacers. So that way it, does, it covers the void and you can tighten it up hard against the car. We're going to do, do it this way and get that fitted to the car. To swap out the spacers is quite easy. Just take out the bolt out at the back. The spacers will lift off. Uh, you'll see two washers in there. Take that out too and just slip in the little spacer. First step is to temporarily fit the splitter to the car. Uh, if you have a friend, they can hold it up for you. If not, grab some clamps like that so you can clamp it to the position and then we'll focus on alignment. Okay, now you need to align the splitter. So the best way to do it is to get the top of the bevel to line it with the back of the bar, something like, something like that. Uh, if you get it right on both sides and get it in the middle, you can start drilling. Just keep in mind that this is made to suit the OEM bar. So if you've got like a fiberglass bar or some sort of rep, you may need to manipulate the bar just a little bit to get the perfect equipment. So now that I've got it, let's get drilling. Okay, to drill, I'm gonna use an eight mil drill bit. That gives us plenty of wiggle room if we need to do any further adjustments. I've done the drilling, but I just might want to mention that there are two um, drilling points you can use uh, because this is just to suit replica bars and also OEM bars. So you can drill in any of these holes there and also you can use the middle hole if you need to too. But you want to use the one that's further forward. The our splitter does come with a reinforcement brace. So that lives in the middle section, just tucked inside the bar. Uh, once you've got that in there, just use the bolts. So shorter bolts for the side and the longer bolts in the middle five holes because you've got to go through the thicker material. Um, let's go get that done. So your brace just slips into the bar there. Uh, now don't forget, if you're, you, if you're not using the spacers and you're using this one instead of the little one, just make sure you adjust the spacer to the hole that you're using because there are multiple mounting holes. So we're gonna use the front hole and I'll make sure I slide this little washer all the way to the front. Now I'll put the bolts in. Now I'm ready to tighten it up. I've got a four mil Allen bit and a 10 mil spanner. If you have option for the accessories, now's the time to bolt them on. So you've got some uh, long screws and short screws which comes with the kit. Uh, you'll need the long screw if you're doing the winglet and the extension. If you're just doing one of the accessories, then you can just use a shorter bolt. So let's get that on the car. Okay, so accessories are on. All that's left to do is to tighten the bolt down with the four mil Allen key. Just make sure you don't over tighten it because if you do crank it, you can pull out the thread. And there you have it. Split kit all installed with accessories in the gloss finish. So I hope you found this video useful and thanks for watching.